Well, it's a part of Miller Park most people never get to see until now. Brian Goddard has our exclusive access because he's giving us a look at the high-tech secrets of the famous retractable roof. A few weeks ago on Live at Daybreak, I mentioned that it was my wish one day to push the button to open the roof at Miller Park. A few hours later, the Brewers called and said they could make that wish come true, making me the first non-certified operator to push the button. The Miller Park roof is made up of five steel panels covering 350,000 square feet and weighing more than 24 million pounds. Moving at only a half mile per hour, it takes 10 minutes to completely open or close. How long have you been doing this, Mike? Well, I've been working at Miller Park since 1997, and I've been up on the roof since 2001. So this is your baby? This is my baby. There is more to opening this huge roof than just pushing a button. Everything needs to be inspected before every move. The inspectors come up and they'll walk each one of the five uh, tracks, as well as the bogies on, on the roof. A total of four inspectors check the rails to make sure they are in good shape, clear of any obstructions, and then give the all clear to get things moving. Now, I am up to bat. So this is the key to get in? That, that's the key to get in the room. Oh, I'm in. So step one. Step one is turn on the monitor so we can see what we're doing. I don't know, that's pretty tricky. <laughs> I don't know. That's one, two. <laughs> we got the monitors now, we're good. <laughs> the roof has 10 cameras on it. Two cameras per panel, plus two behind home plate to see what is going on at all times. The computer tells us what the roof is doing while the cameras verify it. Then our next step is we're gonna turn on the power to the roof. I think I'm shaking. I have the key, I have the key to the roof. <laughs> Go ahead and slide it in there, turn it, and it should pop up. Okay. The inspectors give me the all clear. Brian, we are ready to open. We are set to open the roof in three, two, one. The inspectors walk with the panels as they move to make sure they don't hear any strange noises. All right, everybody, this is Brian in Roof Control. Uh, everything is locked and the roof is open. Thank you. Thank you, Brian. Sounds like we got ourselves a new operator when we need one. <laughs> Over the past 15 years, the Miller Park roof has been opened or closed approximately 3,500 times. But with the monthly maintenance and the care that Mike and his team give it, Mike says the stadium roof will outlast the building. From today's TMJ4, I'm meteorologist Brian Goddard. That's good to know because we love our roof. We sure do, sure. especially in October and April. Yeah, really. Yeah. Hey, it's a gorgeous.